I don't know how I don't know how he got the balls to mash right there. That was crazy. That was just like next human mash. That was like advanced mash. Like he saw that he had the Shulk vision. Like I don't know. He just had ultra instinct right there. That was crazy. What's good everybody? It's your boy Shaisi and I'm back with another Dragon Ball Fighters video. Today I want to do something different and review my matches. I actually entered a Dragon Ball Fighters tournament and me personally I don't think the run went too well for my standards. I think I did pretty bad but I wanted to react to my matches and see where I messed up and where I can improve and such because you know you won't get better at the game if you just don't review your mistakes and stuff and you just won't get better so you know i might as well turn it into a video so like the video comment what you want to see next and uh yeah let's get into it so the first match we have is against dark rule show he's actually a very good player he uses gogeta super saiyan vegeta and super saiyan goku he actually a very good team very good team also don't mind me right there at the bottom that's not me i'm gonna this is the one reacting that's past shiesty this is the one that's reacting so don't get confused So really right here is where I want to stop first. So me personally, I think a big problem with my gameplay is I keep throwing the Videl assist out with no layers. So basically with Kefla, while I'm playing Kefla, when I'm playing this Kefla baby and Videl team, my main purpose is just rush down. Like I just want to skip neutral and just rush down, but I think I'm approaching it the wrong way. I think I need to layer the assist with like a key blast because throwing out the C assist raw like that will get me in big trouble. But hey man, it's ironic how it actually worked right here. <clears throat> unfortunate drop because we're playing on PC. I'm used to playing on PS5. Unfortunate drop. <clears throat> Just playing neutral and I got hit by the super dash assist combo. <clears throat> yep. Hit by the super dash assist instead of Vegeta. Stomp him down. See right there also I keep the thing. I always get like jittery when I'm in the corner. Cause right when I'm playing with like baby I always go for command grab. When I'm with Videl I always larry it out the corner. But with Kefla I did like absolute. Can we run it back? With Kefla, I just, I don't have a way out of the corner, so I just mash and hope for the best. See, right here, that's not what you want to do. That's not what you want to do. You would just want to get out the corner, but that was a terrible move on me. I tried to get a little mix up right there. I unfortunately didn't block, and that's going to cost Kefla. Oh, never mind, he dropped it. There you go again. There you go again. Another use of the Videl without layers, bro. The Videl C assist is terrible without the layers. I don't know why I keep doing that. Into the baby level three. Now right here, I went for a drag rush that basically just gave up my turn. I don't know why I did that when Kefla was right there. So he was about to come back any second. I could have just staggered him. But I just gave up my turn. And I got hit right there. Yep. Into the Vegeta combo. <clears throat> Into the Gogeta level 3. <clears throat> and that reflect right there. That's going to cost me the entire game. I should have just blocked right there. I was too antsy. And I thought I could get a reflect into a raw tag. But no, he was actually baiting the reflect. So I got to start learning how to block right there. Instead of the Gogeta combo. Gets three levels. I think he gets four. I don't know if that last level counted. but See, right there, that was actually so... That was actually no. That was no. I don't know what I was thinking there. I think I got scared of the Gogeta. Because I think he dash blocked right there. I should have dash blocked back. But instead I threw out key blast. And that's what leads to Vegeta hitting me. I don't know why I threw out key blast. So shamelessly like that. I could have put up the Videl assist. But I don't know. Or I could have did the 236H. That beats key blast right there. I could have got a turn. But. And then right there he gets level 5. Into the combo. 
it's level six, almost level seven. Could have punished that right there. I keep, I keep using six H. I could have done a cross up, and I could have done anything right there. But no, I just six H because I'm too used to playing on PlayStation. And usually the six H would work on PlayStation, but it doesn't work on PC against real players. No dash block. Part of my language. <clears throat> And I spar because I realize he's gonna level seven. I get antsy. And antsy. Gotta watch out. Oh. Right there. See, I'm glad I caught it on this frame. I just need to learn how to block more. Cause I don't really block. I used I always try to reflect. I don't know why I keep doing that, but right there, I try to reflect, even though you, I don't think you can. Cause I think it was a, a it wasn't a gapless block stream, but he did a cross up, so it crossed up my input. And that's how I got a 5S instead of a reflect there. Fuck, I'm dead. Oh and then. My God. Right. And then he level 7s, and then he kills me. So, not a good start. I think that was a terrible, terrible, terrible match. I could have done two, so many better things. That terrible match, terrible match. But let's see in the second match. So, here we go with the second match. Here we go with the second match. I know that he's gonna try to get the Vegeta assist running to get a level seven, so. <clears throat> I get hit by the Vegeta assist. I don't know why I was going in there without an assist. Without throwing an assist out, I should say. <clears throat> Let me move my mic a little bit upward. There we go. Right there was the actual risky move. I don't know why I did that, but see, right there, I did a 6H yet again. That's not good. You would usually want a 6H with an assist up. I just keep doing raw 6H. That's not good. Oh, that was a terrible. No, that was a that was a good jump, but the way I came down, that was terrible. I should have just blocked or did the um, 214, the the zoom move that Kefla does with an assist up. I could have done that to get out the corner. Fuck, but no. Zoom the corner. I yep. That. Yep. And then Kefla dies off of this. <clears throat> right here, I'm worrying. And then Gogeta comes in. Good pickup. Mm-hmm. I'm too used to the PS5, bro. The PS5 timings. I'm not used to the PC timings. Oh, I had him on the double overhead. Yep. Oh, he dropped the combo. Oh. I don't know why I did back dash. It's a super dash. I could have got two H right there. That was stupid. Oh, uh, and I mashed right there. You heard my controller. I was mashing, reflect. I need to learn how to block. I was fumbling under pressure. And then I leads to a, um, six levels. Nice baby pickup. <clears throat> Mm, mm, mm. Into the combo, into the level three. Oh, right there, I tried to 6M with Videl assist. I don't know why I tried that, but he would. I guess he was reading that. Fortunate miss input with the DP right there. I don't think this kills, baby, but. Right there, that's a 50-50. I thought he was going to go high, but he went low instead. Oh my God. He drops a combo, though. What the fuck? Oh, right there. That that was terrible. I should have just blocked right there. I'm too... I'm too... But what do I want to say this? I'm too, like, antsy when I play. When I block, bro, it's just... I don't know. When I think... When I'm blocking, I just think the whole like game is about to fall apart. I need to stop and block, bro. I just 
keep trying i keep trying to reflect guard cancel nothing works but i just gotta block when i'm playing fighting games it's just i get a little bit too aggressive i'm dead yeah i'm dead at least to a big punish yep he drops a combo a lot of drops a lot of drops <clears throat> A lot of drops oh the mix that was actually a gamble right there i could have done so many better things but 6m mix didn't work still staggering he reflects me oh that was a gamble right there gamble right there could have should have called the assist before doing that don't know why i did that just raw Uses the levels. I think this kills me, yeah. This kills me, yep. Mm hmm. Down to just baby. And right now, he's just toying with me. Yep, didn't block the cross up. Not used to PC at all. Got dunked on the head. Could have done so many better things, but yeah. Oh my God. And with that, that actually just sent me to losers. Terrible decisions. I think it's because I was so like nervous. So I didn't really, you know, get into the place that I wanted to. I'm not really trying to make excuses. I just think that's what happened. But overall, that was just a terrible game. Terrible set for me. Terrible set. Here we go with the second match we're facing against Lord Frieza, Rockin' Cooler, Frieza, and Vegito C of all things. I I was generally surprised by seeing Vegito C. I don't really see Vegito C as usually Vegito A or the usual Vegito B, but Vegito C never really faced that one before, but So we start the neutral. I got hit by the Frieza and then Super Dash with the assist up. I think that was a terrible move considering he had the Vegito C ready to be used. I don't think that's a t that's a terrible decision. Can we watch that back one more time? Yeah, this was a terrible move because I thought he was under me, so I thought that he would get hit by the Super Dash plus the assist because he doesn't know where I'm at or where I'm at or where I'm gonna land. So. That unfortunately he knew and then he blocked it which leads to a happy birthday then he tags in Vidal that was so risky right there I shouldn't have done the lariat cause I just basically gave myself to him I just I have no assist so why am I lariating with no assist up <clears throat> cooler things i just can't block i just try to reflect i don't block i was so stupid and then with that the, with that i lost Vidal. <clears throat> then a neutral good pickup with the baby kefla good pickup into the baby combos Another drop because I'm not used to PC timing. I'm used to PS5. Oh, right there. I tried the JS. Baby JS is jumping special. is not really good in neutral. I think that was a terrible or a terrible decision right there. Especially with no assist up. I don't know why I didn't use an assist right there to uh, lock him down. But I could have used the Kefla A to aim it upward and lock him down with the JS into the ground pound. But. To a Vegito combo. He unfortunately drops. I don't know why. Uh, another pickup missed. JS again. That was a good confirm. Into the mix. That was a good chop block. I don't know how he got hit there, but. I did backdash right there, which unfortunately got me hit by the Frieza. 
he just dive kicked again and then this leads to BB death I don't know how I got him by that he just has a totally different play style from what I'm used to which leads to the baby death terrible start not the best start mm -hmm. into the spark I keep sparking but I could just hold the vanish I don't because usually when you spark you try to hold vanish to get a turn you hold vanish and then you just you know do your block stream but I spark and then do nothing after it. I just use Spark as like a get off me tool instead of just approaching people. I don't know why I keep doing that. Pointless Super Dash. I don't know why I Super Dash there. Into the freezer drop. That was a stupid 2H. Now, uh, not a stupid 2H. That was a stupid Super Dash. Just idiotic. I don't know what I was doing there. That was so, so stupid. So stupid. So stupid. So that was that was probably the worst decision. I think hold on. Did I actually approach him with the spark? Yeah, no, I did key blast because I was expecting a down tech, but he up tech, so I should have just vanished. That was stupid. I don't know why I did super dash there. And right here, that was this this was the stupidest thing I've done all day. Just super dashing there. That was so. That was so stupid. And that leads to the Kefla death. And with that, he took it 1-0. A lot of stupid decisions. I'm telling you, chat. I don't. I don't know how to play this game correctly. I, stupid decisions. Into the next match. <clears throat> oh, good pickup. Good pick up into the Kefla mix. He just reflects that. Oh, that was a good mix. That was a good mix right there. That was a good mix right there. I could have 2 h there. I don't know why I didn't 2 h there. I could have 2 h before the Vegito assist hit me, but instead I just blocked it. That was a stupid vanish. I just mashed. It was a scrambles. <clears throat> That was a good punish. <clears throat> Let me see. Go for the mix again. He has to spark. That was a stupid super dash. I got so risky. I don't know. He twisted me for that last set. I don't know why I did it again. That was so stupid. I don't know how I landed that 2M, by the way. That was crazy. Missed a level 3. He goes golden here. Got hit by the 2M. I don't know how I got hit there. I think I was just mashing. That was a... He could have just held advantage right there and punished me, but he didn't do that. That was smart right there. With the baby assist, that was smart. Now I think this leads to a dead Frieza. A lot of mistakes so far, but I'm starting to cook up. <clears throat> I don't know how I don't know how he got the balls to mash right there. That was crazy. That was insane. I don't know how he that was in can we watch that back? That was cr that I don't even know. That was just like next human mash. That was like advanced mash. Like he saw that he had the Shulk vision. Like I don't know. He just had Ultra Instinct right there. That was crazy. No level 3, which is crazy. I don't know why he didn't level 3. See, right there, again, I did it, bro. The the key blast after spark instead of holding vanish. Because I keep expecting down tech, but they just don't down tech. See, I could have just held vanish right there for a turn. but Especially because I had two assists coming back. But I just key blast. 
And then I got super dashed. I didn't block the super dash, so Videl didn't get him to a drop combo. And then I hit him with the freeze assist, which sets up a good combo. I think I dropped this though. Yeah, exactly. I'm not used to the PC timings. Then I don't know what he masked there, but he got hit by the super dash. <clears throat> now I think this ends up killing him. My first win in the tournament in losers, but wins the win regardless. Caught with the Videl assist. Another unfortunate drop, bro. I'm not used. See, in the 6H yet again with no assist up. See, that's why you don't 6H there. You don't do that, bro. You need to have an assist up. You should just stagger when you have no assist. Or back up. I went for it again, bro. Again, I'm just too used to fighting people on PlayStation, bro. They don't block the 6H, bro. I just keep going for that. I don't know why. Ballsy mash right there. That was my turn. He tried to jump out. That's why he got hit. No 2-3-6 key. Instead, he gets hit by the staggers. Dropped the combo yet again. I'm not used to PC timing. Another drop. And then... Yep. Mm-hmm. Not used to the PC timing. Terrible drops. That was a crazy super dash. I don't know why he did that. I think he tagged in Cavalier, yeah. I don't know why I didn't do anything there. I just let that happen. I didn't block that either. I'm getting too aggressive. Too aggressive. And then, see, JS right there. JS right there. That's terrible, bro. I need to stop doing that. Need to stop doing that. That was so stupid. I don't know why I keep doing this. Just stay on the ground with baby. You never want to JS in the air. You never want to use his jumping S. That's terrible. Don't do that. Then he drops a combo with Frieza. I was down there mashing because I thought he was going to be on the ground, but he was in the air and I got hit. And nice Frieza combo to finish me off. A lot of scrambling, a lot of scrambling, a lot of scrambling, a lot of scrambles. Playing too aggressive. Too aggressive. I don't know why I DP there. That could have just killed me, bro. I See, I need to stop and just block, bro. I keep playing with full aggression, bro. I need to just block, bro. Patience is key in this game. If you're not patient, then you're just going to explode. But I just land a DP. I don't know even. I don't know how I land the DP there. <clears throat> Into the Sandman Super. Into the level three. Oh, hold on. What did I hit him with? Yeah, he just keeps mashing. I don't know why he keeps mashing, but he got hit there. Could have killed him if I did a Vidal loose, but I was scared to drop it, so. I just did a regular combo. Then I could have killed with the other level one, but. I did that drop on purpose because I wanted to set up the Saiyan Man Oki, but he got hit there regardless, so. I ended up killing Vegito. <clears throat> Ballsy 2M right there. I don't know how that landed, but stroke of luck. Instead of Adele, grab. I think his controller DC'd right there. I don't know how he got hit there, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Those off the disc in neutral. I got hit there. <clears throat> and 
to the... He drops the Frieza combo. Gets hit by his own disc. That was a great moon jump. And to the punish. And with that, I made the Videl 3-1 comeback. One down. One down. I think I won the set. One down. Yeah. So, I made a lot of mistakes that game. But my opponent just... He made the same mistakes as I did. He just kept mashing. He wasn't really, you know patient whether he just kept pressing buttons when it wasn't his turn so hey man i just came out with the w <clears throat> on to the next set so now we have Lindsay running jiren vegeta blue and lab coat Lindsay is actually a great she's great at the game great player all around good defense good offense just all around great great player i respect her <clears throat> i think this is the set where i made the most tear the the Terrible decisions all around. All around. That was a terrible dragon rush. I don't know why I went there. I should have just kept staggering. Or backed off. That was... I tried to catch her jump. Because I thought she was going to jump there. And I actually layered that with the 18 assist. That was actually a good neutral move right there. I don't know why I didn't go in. I could have punished the reflect. But I just backed off. Especially because Videl was up there she was ready to come back so i don't know why i didn't approach right there can we run that back yeah you see i did it with 18 i just i could have approached right there but i backed off that was so stupid of me anyway the super dash plus assist then there we go the 6h animation and it gets and it leads to me getting punched in the face i should have just l'd right there i could have did a light, light into 6H, that would be a DR crush. Or I could have just light into Dragon Rush, or just staggered since 18 was coming back. I gotta look at my assist, my assist. Going for that mix, I didn't do anything there, I could have crossed up. Another Dragon Rush break. Oh. I actually caught her coming in, so I hit her with the key blast. Another drop combo. I'm not used to PC timings, and then I used the Videlicis because I thought I was gonna confirm that, but I didn't. And see right there, she does the vanish. That was cheap. That was cheap. I don't think I was gonna take that regardless, but yeah, you see, she actually got a turn there by using the hold vanish. She actually got a turn. You see, she, she sparked and then held vanish so she can get a turn. She has two assists up. This was cheap right there. <clears throat> and then this leads to Kefla dying. Mm -hmm. There we go. And now I try to play passive because I have 18 up and I try to use the 17 barrier. They see, there you go. Another use of Adele just getting thrown in neutral like that with no layers, just throwing it out for no reason. Easy 5M punish and I just soiled it. I just, I don't know if it was the nerves, but easy 5M punish and I just, nope. Could have killed him right there, but no. Get hit by the super dash. To the level three. <clears throat> Into the yeah, I think I held up right here. You're supposed to hold down back or just hold back, but I did up back because I wanted to um jump out, but I should have just blocked. Into the lap code loops. Oh, I think I mashed reflect there. That's terrible. I keep pressing reflect every time I see an opening. That's not good. You're supposed to block it out. <clears throat> Is Lisa 18 death? Never mind. Not yet. See, another instance where I just throw off the Videlicis. She wasn't on the ground, so she couldn't reflect. 
but if she was on the ground, she would have reflected and punished me right there because I went in actually. So she could have just reflected to spin, you know, reflecting to, um, you know, reflecting to Super Dash. And I got hit by the falling heavy. <clears throat> That was a risky super dash. She could have just lariat right there and killed me. Yep, exactly. I get hit by the jeering assist. To the lap code loopies. <clears throat> she drops the combo. I don't know how he dropped. See, that was a terrible super dash. And I get hit by the Vegeta assist because I whiffed the command grab. Went for the lariat again. Went for the lariat again. That was terrible. I just basically gave her or gave myself away to her. Don't know why I did that. And I got hit. Into the combo. She drops it. Up oh, into the reflect. She was actually waiting for that because I got hit by the um by the heavy, I think. So she was baiting a reflect. She noticed that she didn't get a full combo, so she was just waiting. Yep. Hit by the heavy into the reflect. Yep. Oh, didn't mean to pause right there, but I think this match, I think I was being a little bit too. Yeah, I think with most situations, because she's playing a very defensive team, Jiren, Blue Vegeta, and Labco, I think I didn't know how to approach. The only character that I know how to approach with on that team is like Kefla. But even then, it's just all rushed down with like no strategies at all. I just rush down with orb, with light orb, with no assist, or I just go in and mash buttons, which is terrible. Or I just go in, call Videl C, then 6 H, which is also terrible. I should just super dash into something, but that's a terrible, I don't know. And then with 18, I just try to play passive. So it's like two styles like clashing. I'm not trying to make it excuses, I'm just trying to break down my gameplay. But. Overall, that was a terrible match. On this game right here, I try to tell my tell myself to um to just stay back and watch her approach me instead. But I don't think it works. Let's see. Playing neutral, stalling out buttons. Mm-hmm. See, right there, I actually did Key Blast into the Videl Assist, which is actually smart. Mm -hmm. Into the Oki. Another time, I did 6H right there. That was terrible. I don't know why I keep doing that. 6H, that's not good. Get hit by the 50-50. Guess low. Mm -hmm. See another instance where I tried to just flail out the corner. I should just block, but instead I did another medium into the vanish, which is terrible since Lace Lindsay knows how to properly react to that. And I get hit by the two S here. And this Lisa Kefla dying. Need to learn how to just just come down and just block. Too aggressive. I keep trying to get a turn out. I actually get the punish here. And then we started lagging a little bit. Oh, my bad. Didn't mean to skip there. To the spark, you see she does that empty vanish strat right there to get a turn. Actually blocking it out. Try to reflect again. That's a true block strain. You can't reflect there. She actually missed right there because I was stuck in block strain from the Vegeta assist, so she couldn't get the dragon rush into an actual mix-up. 
the EX command grab, that was stupid of me. Should have did light command grab instead of EX because she, she she could see the flashes so she knows when to jump. Since 18's only EX move is the grab. So that's the only thing I could have done there. If I would have done 17 car, I would have got blown up. So my only option was grab and she just jumped. That was too obvious. I should have went for the light one instead. That was too obvious. Exactly. Should have went for the light one. Into the Jiren. Now kills 18. <clears throat> I try to approach. Now the Dragon Rush break. See, right there, I could have done multiple things right here. But I did a dash up, and that leads me to get hit. Can we run that back real quick? I could have done so many things right here. Instead of just... The medium or not the medium the light i could have done right here i could have done an air dash into medium i could have done drag i could have landed then dragon rush because sandman was right there she would have to react to the dragon rush with sandman on the field so i don't think she could have seen the dragon rush i got a dragon rush right there but i did light which is basically just you know gives it doesn't really give up a turn but i since i was playing so passive this game I actually just jabbed and tried to dash block, which, I mean, it's my turn, so I could have just approached. I could have done light Rekka, could have done cross up M, could have done another 2-2-H, two, two could have done more, multiple things. But instead, I did dash block and I got hit, which is stupid. stupid. I don't know why I did that, but it is what it is. Here we go, just playing neutral, and I got hit by a straight 2M. She drops the combo. That was a good chase, because I thought she was going to backdash, since she usually just backdashes from my Oki. Well, she doesn't backdash my Oki, but I tip, I see that she backdashed other people's Oki, so I thought she would backdash mine, and turns out she did, and I got the punish. That's just not matchup knowledge. I watch Lindsay sometimes. That's just matchup knowledge. Into the Sandman Super. <clears throat> right here, this was so this was so stupid. I could have done multiple things right here. I could have done multiple things. That was so that was so stupid of me. I don't know why. I just went in with the light. That was stupid. See, right here, I could have called Sandman and did a light and then medium command grab. Or I could have faked the command grab after the light. I could have done 22H. Could have done 22M. I could have done command grab. But instead I just did a super jump into air dash into light which is terrible i could have done 2 2 right here i could have done medium command grab right there i could have done Rekka. i could have done so many things but i did light into 2l which missed by the way but i still get the punish anyway i still get the hit anyway because i did an air dash she wasn't expecting that for somehow <clears throat> spark and I got hit by the super dash hit by the super dash and I think this kills me if I'm not wrong yeah this kills me into the level 5 of Vegeta I thought I was gonna be alive I think I died yeah yeah overall terrible decisions this is the end of my tournament run terrible decisions I mean this is not my first tournament this is like my fourth I think I usually come out as top eight, but this time it was just overall terrible decision making, and um, that would that just led me to uh, you know a terrible record. Some things I need to improve on is stop using the more committal options. Instead, go for something safe like approaching with Kefla six H. I think that's very committal, and that's the reason why I you know just lose momentum 
all the times and I need to stop throwing out assist and neutral without a game plan I just throw them out for no reason but yeah overall I don't really think it was a good tournament run I think this I don't know I just didn't really have any confidence in myself going in and I just I got crushed and it is what it is but that's gonna be the end of today's video let me know if y'all enjoyed more content like this y'all want to see more breakdowns or um watch me um break down some other sets that's not mine but yeah if you like this video you don't know, like it leave a like comment what you want to see next subscribe and uh yeah it's been shysty and uh i'll catch y'all for this in the next video